a complaint blog to make because I want my voice heard on this matter. Um, okay, so cricket phones, pieces of crap. Um, they, okay, I've had three phones from Cricut. Let me fix this. Okay, I've had three phones from Cricut, and they all are pieces of crap. Um, my first phone didn't work, like, randomly one night. It, like, the screen... It, on it, like, the screen had, like, window blind looks through it, so I couldn't see anything. Couldn't read text, couldn't do anything. It was just randomly, like, I didn't do anything to it, it just broke. Then, like, another time, um, like, I was, I got a read from phone, right, and, like, God, that's loud. I got a read from phone and it was a piece of crap because like the light for the flash for the camera just constantly stayed on like and it wore down my battery really 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 fast so yeah that was bull crap but they gave me a brand new phone free of charge and then they like, um, sorry, I'm doing too many stuff for my angry mind. So they gave me the free phone, and then I was supposed to be happy with that, I guess. But that phone was a piece of crap, too, and that's the one I have here. Um, and so. Okay, that's the one I have with me now, and it's terrible because they don't take care of their customers at all. Their phones are crap, like, that's just the phone. Like, the phones themselves are crap. Mine turns itself off randomly, it, like, sends the same text message, like, a hundred million times to people, and Cricket doesn't give a shit at all. Like, I've tried to tell them that. And, like... Then I have to complain about the fact they. How much time do I have? Crap. I don't have a lot of time. Oh, wait, is it three or eight? That's three minutes. Okay, I'm not afraid. Eight minutes, have I? Okay, so they are. Their service sucks. Like, it goes in and out. Like, you go into roaming all the time, and you have to pay extra for roaming minutes, which is BS because they only give you X amount of roaming minutes, and then they're not even, like, good because you use them, like, that. So that pisses me off. And then on top of all of that, like, it drops calls, it, like, the phone itself will just malfunction, like, won't let you answer, and it's just stupid. And, like, yeah, so it pisses me off. Well, like, I sent Drew in to go get the Cricut phone for himself, and, like, I was supposed to get a free month of service and not have to pay till January is what they told me. A stupid fat Mexican bitch, that's what she told me. And lo and behold, I have a $13 charge, which, you know, is not my full bill, but that's still not zero dollars. So I'm pissed off about that. However, Drew's phone, the brand new phone, the battery didn't work. It kept dying, which is BS. And then, like, the, um, he went down and he got a new battery and they gave it to him for free and the lady was all, he would be nice to him. And then, like, it still doesn't work. The phone drops calls, the phone makes weird noises, like, it's not just my phone, it's his phone too. And so that's BS. And so he also was promised a free month of service. This stupid person, this girl, this Mexican person, 
like, and I'm not hating on Mexicans, I'm just telling you who she was. Like, she told, she neglected to tell him that it's a pay a month in advance plan, which I didn't even know, and like, so she neglected to tell him that, so a free month of service to him meant he wouldn't be paying until January for his services in January. Like, um, and so yeah, like, that's what, you know, a free month of service meant to us, was he started it in late November, on the 27th of November, and it should have gone until, you know, the free month of service, where he would have paid in January for the month of January. You know, like, I didn't realize that it was a pay in advance thing. So yeah, he did get his three months of free, because apparently he'd only have to pay for it, like, right then and there. Um, but like, I'm all like, Cricut sucks, and I'm using my Cricut phone to text on this, that's funny. Um, but yeah, so like, it just pisses me off. So. Don't go to Cricket because their phones are crap and they treat their customers like crap. They told the guy on customer service on the phone, told my mom that he's not here to make the customers happy. Um, she was like, really? Really? What are you here for then? Customer service? So they treat their customers like crap. They don't care about you as a customer. They don't care. They just want to make their commission. They just want to make their money. Go to AT&T and ask them about their $60 Go phone. It's the same thing as Cricut. So if you already have a Cricut phone and you're like, oh, it's the most you know, inexpensive thing there is, yeah, <clears throat> ask AT&T about their, their $60 Go plan because it's exactly like Cricut. They set you up with a $1 a day Go phone and then you add the $60 feature, which is unlimited text messaging calling everything for just sixty dollars so go to AT&T don't go to Cricket Cricket will fuck you over and then you'll spend three hours on the phone on customer service over a bill seriously it's so not worth it like I'm sure I left out details because I'm a scatterbrain and once I get in front of the camera and I have music going I'm like Duh. but yeah so their phones are crap, their service is crap, there's no coverage, everything about them is crap. Don't go to Cricket. Cricket equals Antichrist. So go to AT&T, ask for their $60 Go phone, and cancel your Cricket service ASAP, because no one seemed to know where the Cricket corporate office was. No one could tell me, no one could tell my mom, no one could tell Drew. It took three of us, and nothing came of it. They just told him, and my mom that they didn't have the power to do that, they're not there to make the customer happy, and that if they wanted to add a line of service, they'd be more than happy to do that. So they're just out to make money, they just want to take your money, their service is shit, yeah they're inexpensive, but I just told you, AT&T, $60 Go phone, actually less expensive than um, Cricket. So go do that because, seriously, it takes more than just three pissed off people to make a statement like you gotta do it you gotta help like help be the voice in this community that we're not gonna let people treat us like shit and what happened to the day and age when the customer was always right and when the customer was the one who you you know bent over to make happy because last time I checked by me paying my phone bill I pay their bills yeah, that's right, Blue October. Holler. Holler. <laughs> yeah, so do what Justin Fersenfeld says. Holler your ass off at Cricket. Go to AT&T. This is Poison Girl signing off. <laughs>